What's up guys? Today's video isn't going to be too long. I thought I would explain why and what I've done to the car that makes my car shoot flame. So I'm going to explain the tune, the mods I have to do to the exhaust. But first, I'm going to drive it to where I always do the drive by so my neighbors don't hate me and the car has a chance to warm up. And then I'll explain everything there. What's up guys? So I'm at my industrial park because here I can rev my car and no one's going to complain about noise at my house. I don't want to upset my neighbors. So I'm going to explain the tune first and why it shoots flames and then the mods I did to support that. All right, so I am tuned by Stratified. I have three different fuel types, but the one that produces the biggest flame is the E30 tune. But on the 93 tune, it also does, just not nearly as big. But then on my drive modes, I have verbal tunes different. So on normal, when I rev my car, it doesn't really have a verbal. It has that one pop and that's about it. But when I put it into any other mode, it has a lot more verbals. And on that last one, that really big one, that's when it shoots flame. So these small ones, there's no flame coming out. And if you go just a little higher, that big one right there, that's when it shoots flames. So if I rev it in normal, that one pop it does, it doesn't shoot any flames. It doesn't really burble, but in any other mode, the burbles are activated and that's what's shooting the flames. So the other mods I have is a catalyst downpipe. And that's when I noticed it started shooting flames is once I got this tune with the catalyst downpipe. The axle back or the cat back exhaust, it made it shoot maybe a little bigger flames. I'm not really sure, but that's not needed. I'm not even sure a catalyst downpipe is needed, but given what a cat does, I don't know if you would still get flames, but you could. It's not really meant to shoot flames. Like it's not, the tune isn't set to shoot flames. It's just the burbles and they just happen to shoot flames. So I am going to put you guys back there. I'm going to rev it in normal and then I'm going to rev it in a different mode just so you guys can hear the difference. And then it's still bright out. So I don't know if you'll be able to see the flames, but we'll see. <laughs> difference between the modes with the burble tune um i'm not really sure you could see the flames at all it's the middle of the day i didn't want to record it late at night so i'm not sure you'll be able to see the flames but like i said on normal i don't really have much of a burble and on all the other modes i do and that burble is what's causing the flames and on e30 it makes bigger flames on 93 there's smaller ones which right now i am on 93 so again they probably won't be big flames at all but if i fill up my tank before i post this video I will come back here when I'm on E30 and I will do it again just so you can see the flames. I like again, I don't know if you'll see it in the daytime, but I'll try. But that's the difference between the modes and why my car shoots flames. If you have any other questions, just leave them in the comments below and I will answer them. Guys, okay, so that's who tuned my car and how my tune works. The modes change if I have burbles or not and if it can shoot flames or not. But it only does it on that big pop. The rest, it doesn't show any flames. So hopefully that answers some of your questions. Comment, like, and subscribe. And if you say anything down below, I'll be sure to reply. See you guys next week.